Hello everyone. Welcome to Aptitude Jab. This is uh, a set based on bar graph, although it is more, more of a logical DI set. It says that A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H are eight students. They appeared in an examination and the bar graph gives the difference between the number of marks they scored in comparison with like A, B, C, D scored in comparison with E, F, G, H. Okay, so this is uh, the difference that is given. And it says that uh, uh, the difference between the marks scored by, uh, like how to read the graph is the difference between the marks scored by A and E is 10. Okay, and difference between A and F is 45 and so on. So using this graph, we have to uh, find the relation between uh, uh, A, uh, these, we have to find the scores of these people. Okay, so uh, we know that like there are eight people a b c d e f g h now a and e the difference is 10 okay so that means e can be either a plus 10 or it can be a minus 10 okay uh, f is 45 so it can be a plus 45 or a minus 45 similarly g can be a plus 60 a minus 60 and h can be a plus 104 because we are given difference we are not mentioned that which is larger which is smaller okay so these could be the scores of these four people now how do you find b c and d with respect to a so if we see the graph of a and b the difference if you see is 18 18 18 okay and this also if you take 10 and 8 you can say that it is difference of 18 only right one will be minus 10 and then will be plus uh, plus 18 that would give uh, 18 difference of 18 okay so that means b is a plus 18 or a minus 18 okay so that will be the score of b okay then we have uh, relation between a and c uh, 45 5 60 20 104 64 so you can see the difference is of 40 marks isn't it uh, if you see the compare the graphs the difference comes out to be 40 10 and 30 is also the difference is 40 so one uh, a plus 40 a minus 40 okay so uh, if you compare the values right you will be seeing that the difference is same so if you say a plus for c and e so if you want to verify let us check c and e the difference is 30 yes okay and uh, c and uh, c and f the difference is 5 c and g the difference is 20 difference is 64 so this is how we find the difference okay now if you see uh, a versus d okay if you see this this is 57 this is 13 this is 43 this is 77 okay so we we are uh, so if you see this this is 77 okay and so if you take 77 let us see 77 okay so if you take this 10 67 if you instead of subtract you add you get 77 32 plus 45 77 so one could be on the higher side another could be on the lower side right 16 17 77 and 104 27 77 so this could be a plus 77 or a minus 77 okay so let us take uh, any value and see that uh, that if that fits so d and e okay so if you take the difference that is 67 marks okay so that is fitting d and f so that is difference is 32 d and uh, g the difference is 17 and d and h the difference is 27 so this is the relation of these scores with respect to a okay so we can find that uh, so either it will be a plus 18 or it will be a minus 18 so if you are considering all scores we will consider either all scores these or we will consider all scores as these ones so now let us see the questions so it says who among the following can be the student who was ranked third so let us find out what could be the 
who could be the top ranker okay and uh, accordingly uh, we can answer this question so let us say a uh, if a scores the a scores the least then a will be the eighth ranker okay and in the other case a will be the first ranker okay so we we just need to find once then a after that a plus 10 is the next number so 7 and 2 then 18 is the third number 6 and 3 after 18 we have 40 okay so that is uh, the fifth rank or the fourth rank in this case 45 will be the fourth rank or the fifth rank in this case and then we have 45 60 that is the third rank sixth rank in this case this will be the second rank seventh rank in this case first rank and the eighth rank in this scenario okay so the third ranker is either g or it is b so among the options we have the option b okay then if one student scored 56 marks and f was ranked fourth so f was ranked fourth means we will consider uh, this thing right which of the following can be score of the other students so uh, we are considering that f was ranked fourth and that means a plus 45 is uh, a plus 45 is 56 so that means a is equal to 11 so we have to put these values a equal to 11 and see which of these scores is matching uh, a plus uh, 11 plus 32 we do not have 32 over here 110 we need 99 which is not present okay then 65 is also not present and then we have lastly 145 okay so none of the scores sorry f was ranked uh, sorry we f is not 40 56 it is said that one of the students scored 56 and f was ranked fourth so one of the scores out of these is 56 okay so 43 means the difference of 13 so we do not see a difference of 13 between any of the numbers this means difference of 54 uh, we do not have any difference of 54 also this means difference of 20 so we see that g and c have difference of 20 okay g and c have difference of 20 so this is a possible answer okay so this will be a plus 40 so that is c c will be a plus 40 and in this case this will be g which is a plus 60 okay so the answer will be 76 so one student could have a score of 76 if one student scored 8 marks and D was ranked 7th, which of the following cannot be the score of any student? So D was ranked 7th, that means we will consider this scenario. Okay. And one of the students scored 8 marks. So we have to tell which of the following cannot be the score of any student. Now, uh, if we see 8 and 102, so 94, A minus 10, A minus 104, that is difference of 94. Right, so if this is uh, a minus hundred and a minus hundred and a four is equal to eight, that means a is equal to hundred and twelve. So in that case, hundred and two is a possible score. Right, so this is uh, not the answer. Uh, fifty two, fifty two means difference of forty four. Uh, so we have. Uh, Sixty and. 104 so that is also possible right so uh, like if it is a 112 so minus 60 will be this 35 35 means difference of 27 which is again possible okay so we can have a is equal to 112 minus 77 will be 35 so this should be the answer okay so do we have any difference of 62 between these two numbers 8 and 70 the difference is 62 we do not have any difference of 62 between any two numbers so that is the answer to this question okay and then the last question is what is the difference between the marks scored by f and g so f scored 45 and this is 60 so the difference is of 15 marks right so you can see the graph of f and g in every case the difference is 15 right here also you can see the difference as 15 15 and 15 right so the answer is 15 marks is the difference 
So that is the solution to this set and the answers to the questions.